Fans TV post-match analysis of the game that's just finished. Bristol City 1, Millwall 2. Fucking get in there. Do you know what? I, do you know what? I knew it was going to happen. I knew it was going to happen today. I'll tell you why. One, because I didn't go. And two, because I didn't go. <laughs> I've been following us up and down the country for, for seems like a lifetime without a victory. Um, and the one game I don't go... Um, we would listen. We started okay. I think Bristol City um, went on the front foot, but it just didn't last long, did it? This four at the back, um, two holding, um, seems to work wonders now. All of a sudden, they can't seem to break us through. Um, I think his name's Samedo or Samendu. Um, he was giving us a little bit of trouble, but our our back line held really, really firm. Um, I thought Murray Wallace played well. Hutch and Coops are back to their old tricks of um, just being a brick wall. Um, Billy Mitchell done his normal, just sprinting all over the gaff, everywhere, just all over. And Savile, listen, some people have been harsh on Savile. I think we've seen the best out of Savile in the last four or five games, um, doing really well. Vogel Slammer, um, look, he's a centre forward all day long, but I'll tell you what, he's, he seems to be doing half a job there, um, and he's a nuisance, and he's a unit as well. I don't know if anyone's seen so, some sort of like close-ups of him. He's, a, he's an absolute unit. Um, Bury for me is, is is a waste of time. I don't want to put any negatives onto it, um, but uh, Bury is, is an absolute waste of time. He won one foul all game. Other than that, done absolutely nothing. Um, he's an impact player at best, in my opinion. Um, I don't think he's up to this standard. Um, but Bradshaw, listen, Bradshaw's got his um, got his first goal of the season, and well deservedly so, in my opinion. He, um, he he works hard, his work rate's great, he gets in all the right positions, but it just it weren't happening for him the past couple of games. And I'm really, really over the moon that he's got his first league goal. I'm hoping that is going to spur him on. Um, a phobie coming on again, for me, waste of time. Um, yeah, listen, he missed the penalty, but th at the end of the day, you either score him or you miss him. I thought it was a weak penalty, but we've won the game. I'm not going to get too negative about it. Um Look, the tactics are starting to, to, to come through. I'm not going to turn around and say that we've been saying this for at least a season, but um, we're starting to turn things around. And it's because we all know what we're talking about as Millwall fans, and, and now Rowett's starting to listen to us, obviously. Um, but listen, let's take the three points. Someone said five points off the playoffs. I'm, not, I'm definitely not dreaming yet, um, as we've got a very, very hard game against Watford at home on Wednesday, I believe. Um, yeah, but listen, take the three points. It's made my weekend better. Let's hope my under-10s win tomorrow. And I'll see you on the podcast on Monday if you're tuning in. Come on, you Lions.